Tambais America. Let me explain why. I'm about to uh, complete my last task of the day, which is playing as a soccer dad dropping off my investment as he uh, as he uh, call it uh, him getting dropped off all the stuff that I'm doing for him I call it uh, he said that's uh, my investment see uh, see how my investment pay off so <laughs> just chilling right now so hopefully uh, how long this investment uh, when can I uh, I uh, withdraw my investment, son. I don't know. You know, you're 14 right now, so... Uh, mm -hmm. 18, four years from now, uh, college, so... Just to be safe, I'm, I'm looking at 10 years. Hopefully, uh, it's 10 years about right. That's two years after college right there. So, uh, in 10 years, it's 2021, so uh, 2031, that's when I'm gonna withdraw my investment. So, <laughs> 10 years from now, I'll be 60, uh, 65, 66. So, it's retirement, well, extension of my retirement. <laughs> All right, son, I'm gonna hold you to it. That's the reason why uh, it's on video. So you cannot deny it. My title of my, this video is Tambais America. So basically what it means is I'm a bum in the United States. Um, let me explain why. How did I, I became uh, Tambais America? It's sort of somewhat intentional. Uh, the reason being is uh, for the people that doesn't know me, I was in the military pretty much my uh, adult life. And uh, uh, the adult life is a total of 24 years. Um, that was up to two years ago, 2019, it's 2021 now, February 2000. So it's basically exactly two years ago. Um, after I was medically, I was actually medically retired from the army. Um, after that, uh, you know, my my goal was to get in, uh, you know, get get a civilian job as fast as I could, and you know, work again. And I was able to do that. Uh, as a matter of fact, as I was uh, before, I was completely out. I was working already. You know, uh, trying to make those money. And in the process, I was not really, um, you know, I was doing the same thing what I was doing when I was still active duty, uh, which is uh, not have any time for anybody else but work. So uh, when the COVID hits, pretty much, you know, everything slowed down and I was in a, in a in one of the good good job that I thought at that time. Unfortunately, you know, uh, in the civilian sector is a business. So uh, when the business is not making money, the business have figured out how to go to uh, reduce the cost of running a business. And uh, you know, unfortunately, um, 
you know, I was one of them that, uh, you know, that lost the job, which is, uh, uh, which is good because, uh, uh, I understand it because it's a business. Doing anything either, so I got a job right away. Uh, the job was uh, at home, but uh, that one was taking a lot of time too from me, even though I was at home. But it was not. Uh, it was mentally exhausting, which uh, I was trying to, uh, you know, I was hoping to avoid when uh, when I got out from the military, and uh, I had that for a little bit until. You know, I, I realized that uh, money-wise was not necessity for that. Uh, the reason why I got a job, I pretty much got it uh, because of, uh, you know, just trying to stay busy, uh, somewhat productive. And uh, one of the things that, uh, that I came to real realization was, you know, um, not too many people have the opportunity that I do. I uh, have the luxury of not working and still be able to uh, to pay bills, which is uh, the reason why people work nowadays, or pretty much every day. <laughs> people have to go to work to make money, and uh, I'm lucky enough to uh, to have to have that luxury where I don't have to anymore, uh, because not only uh, I have money coming in. Uh, from uh, from the 24 years uh, working in the military, but also my spouse is also working. So I have the luxury. It's actually her that made me realize that my time with the family is more important uh, than try to make all those money and sacrifice the time. And yeah, I realized that, uh, that, that uh, that that's how it should be, and uh, and that's the reason why I'm uh, I'm doing what I'm doing now, and I'm basically tambay. But with that, you know, having having pretty much work every second, almost 18 hours per day for those pretty much my adult life. You know, when you're not doing anything, you know, it's it's a big change, and. Uh, and it's pretty hard for me. It's pretty hard for me. And even now, I'm, I'm still the first one to uh, to wake up. You know, like uh, I'm out of the military, but my my head still in. You know, um, so I've, that's one of the the, the reason why I'm also uh, don't want to work now. For the fact is, I realize that uh, I got a lot of things to work on. Uh, both mentally, mentally and physically, and uh, the biggest one is the mental aspect of it. You know, um, just to make the long story short, is my mind has has not left the military yet, and uh, and that's both both good and bad. Some of those stuff is what keeping me up at night. Uh, early in the morning so uh, I'm working on it try to get uh, both uh, mentally and physically all right so uh, when time comes when I'm ready to go out um, you know obviously I cannot do any more big physical stuff like uh, you know uh, prior to making this video I was uh, planting <laughs> I was gardening and uh, and I'm having a lot of pain right now uh, talking this camera. So uh, and as a matter of fact, that's the reason why I started to uh, I turn on this camera because that's one of the a way of me try to uh, distract my pain by talking. You know, uh, now I'm actually in the parking lot right now where my son played a so uh, soccer right now. So uh, people that. Uh, that are looking at this car or have a glance of looking inside my car is probably thinking that I'm freaking crazy. Hopefully they can see my GoPro camera in front of me and they'll realize like, oh, he's talking to the camera. <laughs> so basically, yeah, to, to sum it up, that's the reason why I'm, uh, that I'm tambay, not working, not, not working, I guess, uh, but I'm, I will still be working, you know. I'm, I'm gonna try to stay busy 
whether uh, and that's the reason why I'm making videos I guess it's one of the way of me try to stay busy you know uh, try to keep me sane to, to sum it up you know uh, there's a lot of things that I'm uh, I need to work on both mentally mentally and physically and uh, as I mentioned physically I'm, I'm in pain right now and obviously the mental aspect of it you can't see so yeah uh, that's pretty much a uh, uh, damn that's eight minutes but I'm gonna cut it off I guess so you guys don't have to uh, listen to me ramble off but anyhow basically uh, what what my vlogs gonna be if you happen to uh, run into this video is basically me doing something it's uh, whether it's watering the plant or going somewhere dropping off my uh, my son to the soccer field or dropping off my daughter to her uh, school and stuff like that so that's 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 one of the things that I'll be doing now uh, to keep me busy <laughs> <laughs> and it's on camera too oh gee did it work? which the one? time lapse? Yeah, I think so ah, no I was practice. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. That was uh, one hour and a half. Son, the door is open. Oh. Seriously? I don't know, I forgot that. Please do not bang your uh, feet on my. Ugh. That hurts me, son. Wow. If the, what it, so you're saying that the car is not your car is not uh, expensive enough to be resistant to that? No, that's the reason why. I don't want my car to be broken. This is the love of my life. <laughs> you sure? <laughs> I guess. See, you're like 30 seconds late, so everybody else get to uh, to leave for us. So uh, you said practice was good, right? Yeah. Go, go, go. Caramba. So, uh, that was uh, one hour and a half of wait, which is, uh, which is okay. Uh, my initial plan was to uh, wash this car while I was waiting for him, but I'm too much in pain right now to be washing any car. So, although. Uh, Why don't you just do the car wash? Ooh, that would scratch this car. Why? No, no, no. Uh, only hand wash on this car. Or uh, touchless. Can't touch it. Why? Why does it scratch only it? water. Because of the, the small dirt particles will, uh, will scratch it. The reason why is um, it's more sensitive when it's black because when black, red, blue, that type of color, will show up real all the minor scratch scratches would not show up in like white car or it's very hard to see it white car or silver car on a black car oh my goodness so, so why'd you get a so black hard. car because i know how to take care of it you remember my uh, i don't know if you remember the uh, functionality over that minuscule thing you could have just gotten a white car and always just wash it within like what five minutes because you're using the the car wash but instead now you have to hand wash it and that's more of a hassle you have up to 30 minutes but i'm retired i'm retired so um i have that 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 opportunity to do it because you're just taking up time yeah it could be one of my tasks but um we will see uh tomorrow uh I don't remember any of my checklist, but uh, it could be one of my checklists tomorrow. So, copy me that? Yeah, yeah, I have to do that. You know, uh, that's part of my uh, accomplishment day. You know, I gotta stay productive. You know what I'm saying? Yep. So, uh, with that said, this vlog is over. Peace.